So songs from the year we were doing algebra and trigonometry <laughs> and these people were coming out of the womb week and it's time to say goodbye to Scott McIntyre. Look at what's happened to me I can't believe it myself Suddenly I'm up on top of the world It should have been somebody else I was surprisingly emotional when they said It's the end of the competition. Even though I knew, like, he's not a good enough singer, but when he got teary-eyed and his family was crying... Oh, his family. Oh, it was just his heartbreaking. His sister and her braids. Oh, I, I love know. his sister. I know. I don't know anything about her, but she just, like, emanates goodness I know. and sweetness. And that's the thing with Scott. Like, he's not the American Idol, but no. he is honestly no. maybe the least calculating reality show contestant ever. He's like a ray of purity in this genre that's so cynical and dark and contrived. And yeah. it was just kind of sad to see that go. I don't feel like he's a famosexual, you know? No. It's not like anything for fame, no. oddly, even though he made it to number eight on the yeah. show. And when he sort of talks back to the judges, it's you know, funny. it's funny. It wasn't that bad. Love everything about Scott, yeah. except for the singing. Exactly. I don't understand though, why did the judges pretend that they were deliberating because A, when the judges save was announced, it was announced as it has to be a unanimous decision right. from the judges. So when Simon said, well, we're two and two, like, yeah, Paula and Kara were going to convince him. I love him. how Kara always tries to make it look as though she is trying to convince <laughs> Simon and Randy. Like, yeah. she's like, come on, give them a chance, guys. We all know they're not gonna use it. It's the end of the competition. Dial 1-800-GET-YOUR-OWN-SHTICK because yeah. it's Paula's thing to be nice to everyone. Yeah. On behalf of the judges, I, I just want to say that you've been an inspiration to the entire world. And to dance. And this week, Kara was dancing, and she was also advocating on behalf of Scott. And I don't think it's the right shtick for her. She should be another critical voice on the panel. She should yeah. never advocate well, that's the on behalf with of a bad singer. The beginning. She was supposed to bring some legitimate critique, and she just ended up with, you know, artistry, artistry, and her voice <laughs> is so annoying. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Honey, sweetie. That's so Megan. <laughs> Speaking of things that hurt this week, I'm sending back someone to the couch. That person is a noob. Stay right here. You know, and it was like, you got fewer votes than Lil Round. How is that possible? Lil Round's performance was bad. It was bad. And while True Colors was not fantastic, it was better than Lil Round's, you know, Tina Turner life. That's why I love you so dumb. Show. That really had to be like, basically, people hate me. They hate you as a person. Yeah. They hate your lime green sweater that you right. borrowed from Jamara Rogers. They just hate you. Yeah. Go yeah. home and eat worms. I actually really thought True Colors was pretty good. They gave him no credit for rearranging it. Yeah. And he took, you know, what I think is like a really pretty Cindy Lauper ballad and sort of gave it a little bit of a sway and a little yeah. bit of a... Rhythm. I think he looked a little too nervous during the whole performance. There was a little bit of desperation behind his eyes, so maybe that hurt him, but there was absolutely no reason that he should have fewer votes than Lil Rounds. Yeah. Like, none at all. Who except, was voting for her? Except for that he doesn't listen to Idolatry, who has been suggesting <laughs> a buzz cut and like a style makeover for yeah. him for weeks. He's got to do something dramatic, because otherwise he's just destined to finish like sixth or seventh. Yeah. He's, unless he shakes it up and tells viewers like, take another look at me. He can't you know. win though. I mean, I don't think any haircut is going to make him <laughs> eligible to win. Like he can't win. He, he could, is happy he to be could there. He should the be top happy. five. He could. It's yeah, possible. Yeah, it's possible. You know, possible. he's got to try and get every week he can but out of it. But he's not going to win. But yeah, as you said before, who's voting for Lil Rounds? Really? Who who's voting, voting for voting for her? Was Tina Turner dialing like <laughs> 900 times? We're like, that was a pretty good impression. <laughs> she just seems to make misstep after misstep after misstep. And this week, it was like literal missteps because she was doing that Tina Turner walk. <laughs> and it was almost like a drag queen doing a <laughs> Tina Turner impression. It was weird. Hey, now, let's not let's not tarnish the uh, reputation of drag queens yes, everywhere. True. You know, they would do it better. If they're going to do the Tina stroll, they're going to do the Tina stroll. Yeah, and they would do it right. Uh, I thought the two best performances this week, other than Allison, um, were... Because, <laughs> you know, i got to put Allison at the top <laughs> yeah. of everything. I know. Matt and Adam really... I thought were great this week.
Like, I know you don't quite get Matt. I don't. I don't really find anything appealing about him at all. You pointed out how he smiled for the first time, essentially, right. during this performance, and it didn't seem right on his face to me. It seemed like it just didn't seem to work. And I don't know, that, I, that's a great that's, song. That's and a tough critique. He's not going to be able to do a lot with that. <laughs> Sorry, your mouth just doesn't work. I have to say, smiles. you're not getting Matt is the polar opposite of Kara because she wants to tag that ass. Oh, she like, does. You are a talented guy. I think there are a lot of girls out there going, yeah. I hope I see you for many, many weeks. Incredible on every level. She loves to bang oh, that yeah. table. <laughs> yeah, she, there's someone else she wants to bang. Let's get it on. Did you know I am in my sexual prime and you made that song your own? I loved what he did with Part Time Lover. I have to say, he seemed really hip and current. It was a little Justin Timberlakey, but yeah, that's the problem with him. There is a Justin Timberlake already who has a lot of charisma and a lot of talent, and I feel like here's this guy who could maybe be Justin Timberlake's lighting double on a movie set, but I don't get any of the talent or charisma. <laughs> But Adam, I think, stole the show for people who actually got to see him perform. Yeah. All around me are familiar faces, worn out spaces, worn out faces. My mom sent me an email just panicked in the morning that she couldn't see it. And I My said, mom, mom just, I said, just go on YouTube and Google it. And she was able to find it. I think she also bought it on iTunes because she loves him. She says he's definitely going to win it all. Yeah. Just what, FYI, you heard it here first, Carol Baldwin prediction. <laughs> my mother left me a voicemail message where she was like, honey, at my age, there was some like weird allusion to the fact that there aren't a lot of things on TV that like she finds arousing or finds hot. And she was like, Adam Lambert is so hot. He's like the second coming of Elvis. More information from my mother than I want. Right. But she knows what team he's on, right? She does not care, okay. you know. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair <laughs> that's, enough. That's never mattered to but her. But you know what? That's kind of awesome that this like, you know, theater queen essentially is rallying the the mothers of America. That's yeah, great. And, and I think the teenagers and, yeah, and a lot of other love disparate. Clearly, like he gets out the boat. Well, the bottom line is he board. is far and away more talented than everyone there, with the possible exception of Allison. I really like ice cream sodas. You are the world's best chicken killer. Could I have another one? I want the victory special, please. <laughs> 